Thanks for stopping by for Automate CNC Detroit Machine Tools. We'd like to show you our small CNC mill today. This is our model Talon MX200 machine. Those of you that are used to dealing with traditional Bridgeport machines will recognize that this machine is about the same size. It's got a 36 inch bed, it's got about a 21 inch travel on the x-axis. It's a small footprint but it has a lot of big features in this machine. Let me mention again that this machine was built from the ground up to be a quality production milling machine tool. Let's take a look at a few of the features that make it a production tool. Because this machine is about the same size as your Bridgeport, people often ask us, is, is, it a, is it a rebuilt Bridgeport? It is not. It is designed and built as a quality CNC machine. The ball screws in this machine are P4 class. The Y-axis runs on precision ground and hardened dovetail waves. A minute ago we talked about the table, so let's take a look at it. The design is based, again, on our old Bridgeport design. The door removed, flips down so you, the operator has easy access to the tooling and to fixtures. The table is a standard 36 inches long, features 21 inches of X travel, uh, captures coolant in the traditional way. The coolant drops down back into the re, into the catch basin and then returns to the to be recycled and pumped back through the system again. Um, uses standard 5 8 inch T slots just like a bridge port. Uh, something that's a little bit you different than a bridge port though is you do have a tool rack that is mounted on the end here for uh, that will hold the four different tools for you so you can do automatic tool changes on some of your projects. The guard system and the shielding system is set up so that you can easily remove it if you need to depending on your operation or you can add to it depending on what you need to do for your operation. It's something that can be modified to your desires and your needs. This machine features a precision spindle with four bearings. The motor is five horsepower. It runs up to 6,000 RPM and down to 100 RPM. It is a servo drive and a servo motor. And as a consequence, it has good torque throughout the range. It can do rigid tapping. And because it is a servo drive also, it means there is no gear shifting there is no belt changing. You have one continuous setting that runs the full range of operation. Of course, the big difference between this machine and an old bridge board is this has a full blown, real deal, world class CNC control system. This is a Siemens 808D control system. It is a closed loop system. The machine is all servos. And it is all Siemens servos, all Siemens drives, all Siemens motors, Siemens components on this machine. It's not a hobby machine based. It's not based on a PC. It's not based on shareware. It is a real deal industrial control all the way through. You have an RS-232 port that you can feed, that you can feed your programs to the machine. You can also drip feed them through an RS-232. It has spindle speed override. It has feed rate override. It has manual jogs available, and of course, kill switches. All the features that you'd expect on the industrial control. The machine also has conversational programming ability. It allows the operator to stand right at the machine and with basically fill-in-the-blank type forms, program on the fly so you don't necessarily have to go back to a CAD CAM program or sit at a desk to program it. The Talon MX200 features a pneumatic drawbar for changing tools. The tool can be operated either manually or as part of the program. For manual operations, the operator simply hits the button, it releases the tool, he inserts the new tool, releases the button, and the tool is ready to go. As part of a program, you can program up to four tools to be changed automatically with the system. Thanks for stopping by today. We appreciate the time you took to watch the video. We hope the information was something useful to you. There's more information on our website. There's more information about this machine and the other machines that we carry. This machine is designed to be a small footprint machine, but it's also designed so it has big industrial features in it. 
It'll be a machine that could fit into a job shop, a machine shop, your shop, and run in production environment if you, as, as you want it to. Uh, we appreciate you stopping by. Check our website out for more information.